Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. <laughs> it's episode 36, and uh, th this one might end up being a short one. We are on Telos. We're making our way through the uh, Zerka stuff, and I, I knocked over my coffee on the keyboard in between uh, recording. Getting set up for the last episode in this one. We did some minor upgrades to stuff, so our equipment is looking a little bit better. Yeah. Hey, oh. General, are you all right? Uh, all right. I didn't intend to have this conversation now, but we can. What you, you talking like about? You've been standing too close to one of my shield generators. Uh, you're one to talk. I was inspired by your arm. No. Was this Let's do the force thing. If the Republic right. would just rain Zerka in, there'd be no problem. But as long well, as he's Zerka talking, let me drink the rest of what's left of my coffee. Efforts, Telos will remain dead. I can't take seeing my work being used by those bloodsuckers. But there's nothing I can do about it, so let's talk about something else. Something else I can help you with? I got tired of it. Kept dropping my hydro spanner. Figured I'd get a new one. If you were me, you'd probably want to joke about it, too. Actually, it was a souvenir from Malachor. I was lucky I didn't lose more. But at least it gave me something to do, right? Everyone always said I was probably half machine anyway. Something else I can help you with? Okay. Yeah? Now, let's try this again without the accidental conversation. Let's get this over with. <laughs> Ooh, that looks like a shuttle. There she is, one orbital shuttle. Looks like it's in serviceable condition. That's all the moot point, though. Uh, why is that? Bay doors are closed. I don't fancy flying the shuttle through solid metal, so I Thanks. Say we need to find a way to get them open. We'll also need to find the ignition codes for the shuttle, or else we'll have some trouble getting off the ground. If we get all that, I wouldn't worry about what shape this heap is in. I'll get it running. Okay. That's moderately positive. Uh, this droid has been deactivated. Okay, that would be why it's not attacking us. Uh, what's behind door number one? No, controlled by a terminal. Naturally. All right, nothing here. Nothing here. I should know by the map. Alright, we're going to have to go rooting around in there. Is there anything else in here? Alright. Yeah, I didn't exactly intend to walk into it, but apparently that was close enough. Alright. Enough messing around. Let's head down this hallway. Ah, oh, of course there is. Maybe I can turn these off. Is that the only computer? That's the only computer. All right. Unlock the hangar doors. That's it. Uh, yeah. hang on. Let's get Mr. Shieldbreaker here. Mm. What do we have in here? Uh, not much. Lockers. Chemicals. Watchman's Blaster? That could be nice. Alright, what about over here? Parts. Repair kit and another energy shield. Some more shields. I'm starting to collect way too many of different types of shields. Turn off the security gas vents. Ah. Good. All right. Let's see what we can do down here then. Um. Yeah, 
That's what I thought. We got a lot more to do down here. Uh, we need to get to the reactor? Or is it to the sub-level? Okay, yeah. Okay, we got a little bit more to do first. Down the hall. Oh, you know what? Let's... We, I don't think we've done that in a while. I might have been distracted by my spilt coffee, which I'm still going to have to clean up. Grumble, grumble, grumble. Especially since I bought this keyboard to rep <laughs> I replaced the keyboard once already for spilling something on it. That's why it won't let me turn. All right, so let's uh, hit the disable and go from there. Come on, attack him, attack. Gotcha. All right, I wasn't planning on going here yet, but it's in the pack. Credits, 45 bucks. I mean, it's better than nothing. And that's locked. Something behind a terminal. All right, I really, really don't like that speed effect. I mean, I, I like some of the extra bonuses, combat bonuses you get from it. Like we're gonna be able to get a couple extra swings in here because we're sped up. And we'll get a little more battlefield mobility out of it. But when you're just walking around like that, not not as big a fan. All right. Yeah, the overly dramatic music doesn't help either. Um, hi. Well, that is a big droid over there. Can. At last, someone else. Are you... Are you part of a rescue team? Uh, who are you? I'm part of the first Zerka salvage team. I hid here when the turrets and droids went online. Um, I haven't been able to reach anyone. You... You are here to get us out of here, yes? Uh, <laughs> find your own way out. Why would I waste my time? Now, follow me out. I will, thank you. It's just what I needed. More people. Alright, um... Let's open this real quick. Impossible! Alright, then, uh... <laughs> Back up, guys. What do we get? Med pack and some stamina. Okay. I mean, that's better than nothing. I, I have been noticing a lot of bodies. I wonder if we're going to find out that somebody turned all the station's defenses off on something. Something, something, sabotage, something. Alright. Are, are, okay, you're not on my crew list. Let's lead off with that and then start the flurries. Oh, I thought there was going to get a stun in there. Never mind. Bam! Now multiple people are uh, ready to... Alright. Dude, are you just going to stand there taking up space or something? Gamma. Get him. Is that everything? That appears to be everything. I mean, other than the dramatic music. Alright. And what about this door? Oh! Oh my! Alright, let's, um... Uh, start with an ion grenade. 
get an energy shield. Zap. And then these guys. Let's uh, pop an energy shield. Uh, force Valor, Energy Resistance, and Battle Meditation. Get you to get a shield and then... And then Flurry. What is it? Guys, seriously, you had one job. Get your, get your shields up. Oh. Well, that went uh, quicker than I expected. Armor, always nice. Deflector, okay. Yeah, it looks like we got a lot going on here. All right, let's start with the terminal. Okay, nothing to do with the terminal. Nothing there. Nothing but blurry blurriness. This... Might be a holding facility. We might end up getting more familiar with this than uh, anybody realizes. Oh. Or this is a droid thing. Overload, <laughs> overload droid char recharging stations. Yes, <laughs> Bam. 500 XP. <laughs> nope, nope. That is controlled by a terminal. I thought I... That is a nearby terminal, right? Nope. Alright. Uh, maybe we'll get our answers past this door. Alright. Progress of a sort. Anything in here? Nothing. Alright. Let me... Go ahead and save the game. Okay. <sighs> Alright. Now, let's get Mr. Shieldbreaker to do his thing before Tagalong walks in the way. All right. Down the hall we go. Is there anything down here? Oh! Hey! Um... Do I really want to reactivate an HK droid? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, usually that gets us some XP. Uh. Okay. Oh, that gets to the sub-level. I think I got some other stuff to do first over here. I guess since I turned off the... Uh, Poison generators. Anything? Nope. This is getting a little worrisome. We've gone a little little while without anything. Uh, still kind of mad that the HK droid self-destructed, but okay. I mean, if he's going to follow me, let him follow me. All right. 
What's behind door number two? Oh. Hey. Turrets that are not trying to destroy us for a change. Because they've been disabled. Nice. Let's go. Alright, breaker, breaker. And that has also been deactivated. Alright, before I start messing with anything with the name of reactor control, let's go ahead and do another save. Okay. Okay. Start the reactor. Since we seem to need that to open up the uh, bay doors. Oh. This seems to be opening up all the doors that were locked before. Oh. Oh my. That, uh. That looks ominous. That's it. That's it. Oh. And now they're activated. Come on. Let's get these guys now. Come on. Attack him. Oh. We're going to get that funky effect again, aren't we? There's nothing in there. This droid has been deactivated. Um. Alright, then. That is it for now. We've got. That was already squared away. This was where it went to the sub level. I don't think this door was open before. And behind it we got nothing. Oh, that's right, because that's where we found the HK droid. All right. Oof. Before... Before I head down there, let's backtrack a little bit. So I think... Uh, I want to see if these are open right now. Yes. Although, oh, yep, there we go. That's what I was hoping for. Some remains that get us some armor. And parabolic guides. I'll have to see what that's about. And behind this door we have... Loot. Yes. That's why I wanted to backtrack a little bit. A data pad and a double-bladed sword. The data bag contains the ignition code for the orbital shuttle in the underground hangar. Nice. Not. Nah, I wonder if I even need to go into the sub-basement. Parts. Okay. Looks like that's all we got here. Are we almost out? Uh, just keep following me. Alright, I thought you had something useful to contribute. Sorry. My bad. Uh, that seems to be it there. Alright, uh... I know there's other doors that I need to backtrack to, but I also know that I'm going to be backtracking there because that's where the shuttle is. So let's take a quick peek what's down this corridor here real quick. Locked. Oh. Nothing. <laughs> Alright, let's get back to where the hangar bay is and then we'll call it a night. 
cr slightly crazy and very exhausting night. Like I said, it has been a long day. I spilled a little bit of coffee on my keyboard. And I'm going to want to clean that up a little bit more than I already have. Right, that is out. That is... That was not open before. Did I already get through here? Yes, because I blew open that. That's the other part. I, I kind of... I don't know. I kind of wish there was a way to remember where I'd been that wasn't just the map opening up. Because I know there was a bunch of doors that unlocked... Nope. Still locked. I mean, there's clearly something there. So maybe this will be another one of those uh, we'll head back through. Alright. This is where I'm going to leave things. Let me go ahead and save the game. Because I know the next part's going to be... Well, we saw. We saw the little... Uh, when we turned on the power plant... Um, we saw the tank-like object that is sitting there waiting for us. So we know what's in for us on the next episode. Uh, so with all that, that is going to conclude episode 36. Well, that was fun. Unless I just died. Then it was a little less than fun. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you're having fun. And if you want to watch live, you can follow along on Twitch. I live stream the recording of the next six episodes at least once a week. I might even throw in some bonus content here and there if time allows. And you'll find the link in the description below. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when new episodes go up live stream archives from some of my other stuff and various and sundry other videos because i do more than just this and if you want to get notifications don't forget to hit the bell and if you really truly enjoyed it don't forget to give it a thumbs up and all that good fun stuff if you have any questions queries quips quotes comments complaints or other whatnot don't forget to leave those in the comments down below lastly if you're enjoying the show, if you're getting some value out of it, then consider giving a little value back. Go to live.anonjunior.com. It'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, however you want to think about it. And there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So if you're getting value out of the show and you would like to give a little value back, even if it's just enough for a cheap cup of coffee, then uh, consider going, giving a little bit especially if it tickled the nostalgia or opened your eyes to a new game that you might play. And uh, with all that said and done, we're, uh, we're going to cut out, have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.